I had a call from a guy that saw my 69 Camaro on the website. He said, I'll take it. Full boat. Just said, I'll buy it. But I want you to get me a new 17 convertible. Two hours. It's not here. I've got a client coming. I'm going to lose my deal. I got a guy coming. Both cars, I need them lined up in a perfect world. I'll change Marcus's title. I can see it all now. Fired. If I can make this deal, this bad day will turn into a good day. That would be nice. I don't know what to do. He's not picking up his phone. Where you been? I mean, this guy's gonna be here any minute. I don't want to blow my deal. By the way, your buddies in the AC business never showed up. I'm I know. dying he, he out He called of me, he said it was running late, so I figured why come over here and be hot? Oh, you've been cruising around? Yeah, top down and air conditioning on. That's nice. That's it really nice. It runs good. It's a nice car. And what's this banana? Not a banana, it's a Camaro. 6.2 SS? It's the only SS they had. Put a taxi sign on it. That's between you and the guy. Not me. That's the only one. The only color they had was yellow, and that was it. It's Everything a else, they had all the different colors for regular ones. I guess SS. it has appeal. Yeah. You've driven them both. How does this 6.2 compare to this? Runs very smooth, clean car, air conditioning. It's a convertible, that's a hard top. The only thing I don't like, it has a computer. Other than that, this car has an eight-speed transmission automatic. It has a three-speed transmission automatic. With this transmission, it goes zero to 60 in 3.9 seconds. I confirmed it today. I don't need another ticket today. You don't need to go so fast. The speed limit is 60, Ted. I wasn't going faster than 60, maybe 62. In a 35 zone. No, I got on the expressway. I mean, if you're gonna do it, do it right. It's very pretty. Oh, it's a beautiful car. I think the guy's gonna be thrilled with the combination. But I wonder what it'll cost when that eight-speed goes bad. An arm and a leg. You know, it's funny that 1969, they sold just under a quarter of a million of these cars. And these 2016s, they only sold like just over 72,000 of those. Hell of a difference. There's a huge difference. This is actually a 2017. All right, so they're not even done yet. No, I'm talking 16 numbers. Yeah, but but uh, there's just so many of these were made. These are the most popular of the Camaros. Ted, how about this? Before your client gets here, take it for a ride. Let the wind cruise through your hair that you don't have. And I'll see you later. Don't quit your day job. Funny guy. Some people negotiate, some people don't. I don't force them to buy a car at any price. Some people just don't like to haggle. I didn't really take this guy as serious until I got a $50,000 non-refundable deposit. Then I'm taking him as a real serious guy. Well, Jason, here are your babies. First generation. Sixth generation, 5.7, oh, automatic, yeah. no air, which you can put air in if you want it. Oh, it's just this a beautiful is it. car. 69 is the best of the best. This is the car. This is me. I've been dreaming about this car since I knew about cars. But I had to have this one because I got to be this guy sometimes. The only car I could get was yellow. I wanted yellow. You're kidding me. No, yellow's really hard to pull off. But you got to start with wearing no socks. Gotcha. I got these. That works too. For me, it does. <laughs> Today, I bought a 1969 Camaro and a 2017 Camaro SS. I'm super happy with these two. I had Ted go to a dealer for me. It was a really good choice. I mean, nowadays, you can have somebody grocery shop for you, so why shouldn't you have someone go pick up a car for you? Do you like this car, Ted? I like it a lot. I had to have something new. Now, you don't do this brand new stuff very often. No, but you wanted it, so I went and got it. No, I didn't want to buy it from a dealer. You know, I got 36.5 for the car. If he would have wanted to negotiate with cash, I probably would have taken 32 for the car. He didn't want to even hear that. He didn't have a problem paying me. He just wanted me to make his deal easier by going to get him his Camaro for him. And I said, all right, fine. So it works. It's a more profitable deal for me. As far as trading goes, if I had a choice of trading either the 69 or the 17 Camaro, I would take the 69. Because every day the 69 goes up in value, every day that goes down in value. I'll take the old car every day. You spent 86,500 bucks with me. You happy? I'm super happy. I don't like going to these dealers, Ted. I like what I want, when I want it, and I don't mind paying for the convenience of it. I got what you asked for. And it was worth it. Yeah, that's right. And I've looked for this car all over the country, and it was here all along. And you got me this one, and I didn't have to talk to nobody. You're one guy with two cars. How are you going to get the cars home? I honestly have no idea. I didn't even think that far, Ted. You want to uh, drive one of these? Yeah, I'll drive the 69. I think you're going to have to try to pull off yellow. Can you pull it off? I could. I think you can. I can. I think that the handlebar will pull off anything. All right, let's go do the paperwork. Ready to do the paperwork? Yeah, man, come on. Let's do it. And I'll get you out of here. I'll sign whatever you got. I couldn't be happier with the deal that I got today. And I didn't have to do any work to find the newer car, and I got the car of my dreams. I couldn't be more thrilled. Jason showed up. He was so excited by the deal, he forgot he had two cars here instead of one. I said, yeah, I'll drive the AC-powered Camaro down. I'll take it home for him. I'm in no hurry to get back. I mean, I might stop and have a bite with the guy. It's hot in here. I don't want to be here.